back in school, but summer isn't over just yet. No, this morning Chuck's Big Adventure has taken us up to a spot just a few hours away from Indy for a perfect quick getaway. And Chuck, I know your next stop includes a very sweet treat as well, which you know we're grateful for. Oh, I know you are. You know, blueberries are a way of life for many communities along Lake Michigan. And we met one family that's been keeping the tradition alive for decades. Michigan in the summer is all about blueberries. There are thousands of acres of blueberry fields in this state, and the DeGrand Champ family contends these Michigan berries are the world's best. Why are they so good? Well, I think uh, we're one of the oldest growing regions, and we've been doing it a long time, so I think we know what we're doing around here. This now third generation operation is truly a family affair. My folks bought this original farm right where we're standing, 1958. So we're estimating these bushes here about 85 years old. Wow. Mike, you've been doing this since you were a little boy. Right. How has all of this changed? Well, it's tremendously the technology and everything. 30,000 pounds you guys did yesterday. That boggles the mind. Yeah. How do you get so many blueberries in here to begin with? Well, we have a picking crew of about 94 people, give or take, that are picking on an average 25 to 30,000 pounds a day. Plus, we have a machine that's out there picking really as much as they possibly can. There's a lot of work, Adam, that goes into buying that pint of blueberries at the grocery store. Oh, certainly, yeah. We package under the Nature Ripe brand and they get distributed to Costco, Sam's Club, Walmart, Kroger, any of your local stores. Want to pick some blueberries yourself? No problem. There are fields for just that purpose. So you want to have two free hands, that's why we're tying the bucket to our waist. And you kind of just want to tickle the fruit off the bush and roll it under your bucket. And you remember when you eat blueberries, eat four or five at a time, not just one at a That's time. That's right. Because there's a little bit of different flavor depending on the ripeness. At the DeGrand Champ store, you'll find blueberry, well, everything. They even make blueberry ice cream, which I had to sample, of course. Excellent. I see why this is the favorite. <laughs> Thank you, Mylon. Wow, that's good. That really is good. <laughs> you still like blueberries? I do, I eat them every day. The cutie. Oh my so gosh, cute. we had such a good time there. Full disclosure, I put more weight on this trip than any Chuck's Big Adventure ever. From blueberries. <laughs> well, that's okay. Maybe a little more than blueberries. Oh, did. but you know, these blueberries are available in stores locally. They're under the Nature Ripe brand, mm -hmm. and you look uh, for that brand and then you can also order stuff online like this these blueberry preserves are wow. awesome and then they have dried blueberries too but whatever you like blueberries in you can get them all there and it was just a wonderful you time. You learned a lot on this trip didn't you? I did like when you go to the store to buy blueberries mm -hmm. Sometimes they're out, you know, in the produce mm -hmm. department. Don't buy those. Uh -oh. Go to the ones that are refrigerated. Uh -huh. Buy your blueberries at the store that are refrigerated. I went to a grocery store yesterday yeah. and I saw in both places. So, uh, and I forgot to bring them. It uh, but it, it, yeah, and it's just, it's better because they're, they're shipped refrigerated okay. too. So it's better all the nice way around. Tip, but we're not finished yet, are we? Nope. Tomorrow we're wrapping up our trip with some fun in the sand and we're not talking about sitting on the beach. No, we're talking about an oh. adventure. I'll introduce you to sandboarding and go for a wild ride through the dunes. Uh, boy, we're going to have a good time. You're going to want to see these pieces tomorrow. And of course, you can catch up on all the pieces that you missed. Find more in our blogs. It's all at WTHR.com slash Chuck's Big Adventure.